Hello, Roger Comiskey here speaking to you from the Royal Dublin Society in Baldsbridge in Ireland. I'm uh, currently doing a, a small exhibition of my Joycean work here at this uh, show, which is run by the uh, Senior Times Limited group, who are a group of publishers. And they also uh, staged the Over 50 show, which I did for the first time 13 years ago and uh, haven't been back until this year. They also have run this Over 50 show in Estepona for the last five years at the Palacio de Feria y Congresos. It's not, however, been run this year, but they're hoping to come back and do it again in 2013. This is a look at some of my work, which is all based on uh, James Joyce's Ulysses and Finnegan's Wake, and also on some of the poems of James Joyce. This here is the, from the door of Seven Eccles Street, um, which I did some years ago. Most of these paintings are watercolours. Um, here are two more down here, James Joyce specs, which are uh, symbolic of the glasses that he used to wear. And this one here is called Good Puzzle Would Be to Cross Dublin Without Passing a Pub. This one is sold. This here is Banhoff Strasse, which he wrote. This here is uh, River Run, past Even Adams, from Swerve of Shore to Bend of Bay, brings us by a commodious vicus of recirculation back to both Castle and Barnes. Here we have uh, Eche Poor, which is a sad and poignant poem that Joyce wrote when his father died and just after his uh, grandson, Stephen, was born. This here is uh, the River Slaney. And here is a portrait of Joyce, as you can see. This here is, uh, this here is uh, multiple Joyce, I call it Joyce the Pluralist, which is uh, reminiscent of the styles popularised by Andy Worrell. Here's Mr. Bloom. Mr. Bloom, which is after a drawing done by James Joyce in Myron Nutting's studio in Paris in 1922. Molly on the chamber pot is from Penelope episode in uh, Ulysses. And here's a small view of some of the other paintings that I have. I hope you enjoy them and that you come back and have a look at my uh, other work from time to time. Thank you very much indeed. I look forward to seeing you again soon. Bye-bye.